Uh, I'm going to give you guys my, to follow up on the, the, my panel up here, um, my, my best tips that I did not give on how to write a book that goes beyond the bestseller list and creates a movement and creates a small fortune for you if that's something that you desire. But I think that too much emphasis in the book industry right now is put on hitting that bestseller list. And, and it's really, number one, you can hack it and sell 12 books in a, you know, an obscure category on Amazon and now you're a bestseller. Um, but too much emphasis is put on it because think about the value that it adds to your life and to the world is very limited. You think about, it doesn't make significant money necessarily to hit a bestseller list, and it doesn't impact significant amount of lives. And I would think that those are the two ideal outcomes for all of us authors, right? We want to make a good amount of money from our book, and we want to impact lives. So, here, well, I got a lot of time. Uh, so here's, I'm going to slow down. So here's the keys. So the number one key is, You've got to incorporate daily behavior change in your book. A book that creates a movement is one that changes daily behavior, and that's very few books. Most books get you to think a little bit differently, right? You think a little differently, and then you forget that you thought differently when you read that book as soon as the book's done and you're reading the next book. But if your behavior was changed as a result of the book that you read, that never goes away. And it starts coming up in conversation, and your book starts creating a movement. So the way you do that, by the way, if you don't have a miracle morning you know, type of book, is create a ritual around your content. Create a daily ritual around your content. That's my number one tip. And the second tip is build pay it forward into your book. Share a story in the beginning of the book about how someone paid something forward that they learned that added value to your life, and as a result, it's changed your life. Plant that seed and then massage it throughout the entire book so that they've got the idea that, hey, if this changes your life, share it with other people. For me, in my book, in the beginning, I say, hey, if this is changing your life, get an accountability partner to hold you to this so it can become a habit. So to write a book that goes beyond the bestseller list, those are the two biggest keys.